Haley out in here, joined by SMU head coach Travis Mays. Coach, congratulations on the win. Last time out against East Carolina, you lost a really tough one on the road. This is a physical team. It always seems to be a close battle. What is the matchup like with the Pirates? It's very tough. Uh, they have uh, a similar team to the team that we have. They have two shooters that are extremely good, and they shoot from deep range, so they stretch the floor a little bit. And they have a post player that's, that's very similar to Alicia. She's very, very physical. She was, she was a one-man army tonight. She was getting our team in foul trouble. She was scoring baskets, so she kept her team in it. So it's, it's always a tough battle. I'm just glad we came out on the, on the, the better end tonight. Big night for Alicia Frawling, a double-double, led your team in scoring and rebounds. Why is she a key to what you do? Well, Alicia, from day one since I got the job, I've watched her work ethic, and it's been absolutely the same. So to go out and see her motor, to see her energy, to see her competitive uh, spirit, I think it's contagious. But I expect that each and every night, and, and I'm just glad she's playing for me and not ECU. And then coming out of the half, it looked like you guys really dominated in the third quarter. What were some of the adjustments you made at halftime? Well, what we wanted to do, uh, we had gave up a couple threes. Uh, we, we used our bench. Our bench came off, and they gave up two threes right away. And it gave ECU some confidence. So our adjustment was we was planning on just not letting them get any more threes off. They was going to have to either get to the basket and go through our defense to do that. And, and, and the players, the team stepped up. We gave a few too many transition baskets, but they stepped up, and we were able to hold them off. No easy games in this tournament and a short turnaround in terms of rest. A tough USF team you have to face tomorrow. What are some of the things you'd like to do differently this time around? Well, I like to play better for number one, uh, not to give up many threes. Uh, we played them extremely hard on our home floor. They were able to get a, come away with the win, so we know it's going to be a tough game for us tomorrow. Uh, but we're excited. We know every game in the postseason is going to be a fight, and you've got to earn everything just to survive in advance. All right, we'll see you tomorrow, Coach. Thank you. Looking forward to it. Thank you. I'm now joined by Alicia Frawling. Alicia, great game. Congratulations on the win. 23 points, 12 rebounds. What was working so well for you tonight? Um, I think that my teammates really set me up well. And then, I mean, I wanted to win. And we all did. And I think that showed. We all showed up tonight. And I think it was just that grit that got us over the line. That matchup inside with Kristen Gaffney, it looked like a really physical battle all game. How tough was that? Um, it was tough. Um, I mean, she's a good player. But, I mean, we got the win, so I can't complain. And moving on, you kind of feel the pressure of the postseason now, fighting to stay alive. You've met USF earlier this yep. season, a close game with them. What do you guys need to do tomorrow? Um, I think if we come out and play like we did today, um, just refuse to lose, and then we'll see what happens. But we're definitely aiming on winning that game. All right, thanks a lot. Good luck tomorrow. Thank you.